in the Pixelmator Pro Prism update, which became available in early 2019, the Layers panel got some nice upgrades. We can now quickly adjust layer opacity and blending modes from right here in the Layers panel. I have the column layer selected, and I can now use the slider down here to change its opacity. Use the menu to the left, and we can select blending modes. Change to a different layer to adjust its opacity and blending mode. Previously, we had to make opacity and blending mode changes using the style tool over on the right side of the window, which would mean leaving a tool that you might have been using and then having to go back. Thankfully, that's no longer required. We also have a new search field at the bottom of the layers panel. If I enter the term black, only the two layers with that word in their name will appear above. Click the X here to clear the search and view all the layers again. This makes it even more important to remember to name layers in documents that have a lot of them. Just double click on a layer's name to change it. Click the button to the right of the search field and we can filter layers by layer type or by tag. If I select text here, only the one text layer in this document is visible. Check shape layers and that layer is now visible as well. Click clear all to view every layer again. Finally, we can now tag layers by color. To tag a layer, right click on it and assign a color down here. I'm going to tag the text and sidebar layers red, and then these two black and white layers gray. As I do that, the color is added to the right edge of the layer. And we can now use the filter button to only view layers with certain tags. So the Layers panel in Pixelmator Pro is now much more useful with the ability to quickly adjust opacity and blending modes, along with layer search, filters, and tags.